We're talking about dangerous bacteria. They know what I'm talking about. You can pick it up, by the way, before you even get on the plane. There's a new study out of the U.K. finding those plastic bins in the security line have the highest levels of viruses at airports. So how dirty are they here? And what's the germiest part of the plane? This morning, it's the what germometer. We're pulling it out, swabbing everything from the TSA bins at the airport to the armrests, the seatbelts, the tray tables on the plane. Buckle up for this one. It's a medical emergency. Just weeks ago, an Emirates flight landing in New York quarantined. Back to your seat. Please keep the aisles clear. 19 people reporting flu-like symptoms. Just one day later, two more flights landing in Philadelphia quarantined. 12 passengers complaining of the same symptoms. Health officials say it was the flu likely caught overseas. So how germy are planes? The Rossin Reports team putting on the gloves to test it all. Swabbing surfaces at major airports and aboard major airlines to find hidden bacteria. Let's see what we got going here. First up, the bins at the TSA security line. I get in there, swabbing it all, even the handles that you touch. Oh, look at that. 616 on the germ meter. Anything over 100 on this is a fail. So these TSA bins have failed by a lot. And by the way, a couple of TSA workers just walked by and they said, they said, what are you doing? And I said, oh, we're testing these for germs and for dirt. And they said, you don't need the germ meter. They're gross. Even they know. They touch the stuff all day. But the news gets even worse. We send the samples to a certified lab. The TSA bins we swabbed contain E. coli, Klebsiella, and something called Acinetobacter. What is all this stuff? They're all bacteria that we find normally in our intestines, so we call them fecal bacteria. Ugh. So it just means that those surfaces are contaminated with, with poop. Aside from making me sick to my stomach right now, can this really make me sick? Yes, these are bacteria that can cause infections in healthy human beings. So you can have these bacteria on your hands, you touch your eye, you certainly can get an eye infection. If it uh, gets inside a cut, you could have a, a tissue infection. To give you an idea how gross the TSA bins are, let's compare them to the airport bathroom. I swab the toilet. Remember, the bins came in at 616. Look at that, only 32. That means this airport bathroom is clean. It passes the germ test. The airport bathroom toilet and the flush button are cleaner than the TSA bins we put our hands on and our stuff in. Gross, but how bad is it in the air? Let's fly. Okay, get on the plane. We swab it all from the armrests. 429. Those armrests are really filthy. To the seat belts. 589. This buckle is disgusting. That seatbelt also testing positive for a Cinecobacter. Remember, that's the bacteria that can make you sick. But this next test even surprised us. I'm scared to see this. The tray table. I swab and swab. <gasps> Guys, 1,688. That is sky high. And look, this tray table, it looks clean.